Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to fix your HP laptop or PC if it doesn't have any sound or audio. Okay, if you found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. Now, first up, go ahead and open up your search bar right here. Type in system updates. Okay, go ahead and click on check for updates. Click on it and wait for it to load. Now, once it loads, go ahead and click on check for updates. If there are available updates, go ahead and install those. And once done, don't restart your computer yet. Okay, go ahead over to advanced options. Click on it. Now click on optional updates. Okay, same goes right here. Install all available updates, especially those for your speakers. Okay, sometimes it will say Realtek or maybe Intel. Okay, just go ahead and install everything right here. And once done, restart your computer and you should be good to go. Now, if that soon will work, go ahead over to your sound settings right here. Just click on sound, then click on this icon. Then click on more volume settings. Okay. Click on it. Now in here, if you have multiple devices or speakers, make sure that you select the speakers, high definition audio, then click on it under advanced settings. Make sure that you choose device default effects. All right. No audio enhancement. Okay. Once done, go back, scroll down. If that still won't work, click on output device right here under troubleshoot. Okay. Just click on it. Now simply follow the troubleshooter right here. Just click on yes. If it asks for a consent for an automated diagnostics, just click on yes. Wait for it. And then just follow the simple prompts and hopefully it helps. Okay. Now if that still will work, go ahead over to your search bar and type in device manager. Okay. Click on device manager. Once it's opened, go ahead over to your audio inputs and outputs. Click on a drop down, locate speakers, click right click and hit on update on stun click on browse then let me pick select audio endpoint and then hit on next okay close now close this one restart your computer and after that your audio or sound should be back now okay make sure that you use the slider to adjust the audio level okay there you have it well i hope this video helps and i'll see you in the next one